but I'm very excited that um, finally we are meeting again uh, just to see how we can partner with uh, uh, the county. Uh, when we took over last year, uh, and of course before our inauguration, uh, Shinyalu people are very passionate about um, a tea factory being uh, one of the uh, programs that they're very excited to have. And um, for the last several years, it has been a story. And one of my questions I was asking my team is, um, first and foremost, it's good to have a tea factory. But do we have enough leave uh, so that at least when the factory has finally been set up, uh, we don't have challenges. Uh, so that requires investment uh, in having uh, tea bushes. Uh, the environment is quite favorable. And um, I was trying to grapple with how do we now uh, set up a tea factory here, because it has really been a story. Um, so in this proposal of uh, uh, Mudete, uh, I got a wind of it. I told the DG that you need to fast track the conversation uh, because at least when we have Mudete and of course the bigger KTDA with the current tea reforms uh, which are ongoing, <laughs> at least we expect that this is going to be a viable project. And the fact that we'll now be um, establishing the factory on the shoulders of an already existing infrastructure. Um, I was one of the proponents of having satellite factories. And uh, uh, this has been long overdue for Mudete to have a satellite factory. Um, and of course, maybe uh, Munyale will need to tell my team what is a satellite factory. Um, my little understanding, of course, is um, when you have a satellite factory, uh, some of the administrative costs uh, will still be borne uh, by the mother factory. Uh, that is good uh, And of course, as a startup, it is a very um, a good thing to have so that we grow the factory by increasing. Uh, the green leaf. So that green leaf thing is uh, is very important, and I'm happy that um, the CS Agriculture is here, uh, who is going to give us assurance on the programs uh, that you have.